Do you think the old pitch is like the old turf in the garden here? <laughs> Probably. A mess. Pitch gate. Pitch gate. And your prediction today? 3 0 Brentford, 3 goals in the first half. Okay. Second Bristol, you, my friend, are a lucky omen. Last time I interviewed you on the side, it was at Norwich away. You called a bees victory. What are you saying today, mate? I'm calling a bees victory today because it's a League One. Coming up from League One, very different atmosphere, different type of football. I'm saying Brentford win three one, mate. It's been a bit of a bit of a bit of a turbulent week for Brentford. Yeah, the kids played on Tuesday night, but it's a different game. The, the proper guys are playing today, so I reckon we're going to win 3-1. Yeah. So, Bristol City fan, yeah. proper, proper old school top on. You got it. Now, obviously, you've been coming for a few years. First season back up in the Championship. What, what's going to happen today, mate? 3-1 uh, win today. So you're, you're obviously you're confident. You lost your first couple of games this season. Yeah. Putting up behind you. Yeah, yeah. 3-1 today. It's quite a big game, isn't it? I think it is. Second game of the season, first away game. Uh, had a bit of a rocky start, like you say, this week's been a bit bit tough for the uh, cup, cup game. But I think we'll win today. 2-1, I think. What's happened today? Um, hopefully we'll try and win. We'll try. I'm sure we'll try. Try, but I don't Are know. Are we going to do it? I hope so, yeah. I think we could. If we get the first goal, we'll be alright. It's been a bit of a dodgy week. Yeah, it's a bit worried. We're going to end the week on a high. Hopefully. A bit worried, though. It's been a while since I've been worried. I think we'll do it 1-0. 1-0. What do you reckon? I don't know, to be quite honest. They take shit on Tuesday, so I don't know. Give us a ball. Give us a number. 1-0? 1-0. We've got to take one. 1-0. Go on, Ubi. Go on, Ubi. Go on, Ubi. He's a, a dapper, a dapper Robin here. A uh, proper, proper dapper Robin. Yeah. I can't do the accent. So what, what's happening today, mate? Well, first game back in the championship. Well, it, it, it's getting the. I'm gonna. I'm not gonna stand too quick, in case we score us first and it collapse. So I'll wait and see what happens. But I think we got a fabulous chance. You're confident. Uh, of course I am. Yes, of course I'm confident. So, so do you wear this garb every every game? Uh, is it only, yes. when, only when Brentford are in. No. no. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Come on, you bees. Garb. Come on, you red. Hey, mate. What do you reckon? What's, what's that? Uh, I reckon we'll run out and fail to score, and then uh, we might score, and that's about we it. We might score. <laughs> we might get a shot on target. So you're not overly confident. <laughs> not really, no. We lost the first couple of games, so yeah, and we always lose to Brentford. So, well, we don't always lose. No, uh, I can't ever remember beating them. I hope you're right. Right back to the Steve Perryman days. <laughs> Jesus, I, I remember well. Yeah, yeah, it's true actually. Come on, bees. City fans in a bounty up to two pounds today. We're at Ashton Gate. Brentford need to get a positive result, don't they? Positive result, positive performance, and. It's for the players now to show and put last Saturday and Tuesday at the back of their minds. On great grey starts, which is a good big statement. Big positive. Uh, he looks good pre-season, looked good when he came on, on last Saturday, and I think he gave the boys a bit of a lift. Hopefully this will be a big lift today. goals in him, isn't there? Yes, goals in him for definite, yes. It's a good boy. He will score today, yes. And increase his value. Up the Bs.
the day to see the mighty bees. That was a bit of a feisty first half, mate. A lot happened. What do you, you think of it? I think the referee's uh, a bit biased, but uh, I think the boys are doing well. I think they've uh, got to make the extra man count to keep passing it. Make the uh, extra man count because they're down to 10 men. I think um, Andre looks sharp up front, very sharp. I think the defence needs to get more tighter. Uh, but we're doing all right. I'll be interested to see how the uh, second half pans out. More goals in this one, mate. I reckon there is, mate. Uh, three points for the boys, that's what I want. That's what I, I want. Roller coaster ride first half. What you make of it? Well, it's all right. Confident that we can come out on top second half. Moving the ball well. Just got to tighten up on the spaces. Got far too much space down the left hand side. Is it more goals in this? A lot more goals. For or, Brentford. Or for Brentford. Can't you be? Or for Brentford. Can't you be? Fantastic, yeah. I've just asked someone, how do you feel after this game compared to last season when we came out after losing 1-0 to Bournemouth? Don't think, um, I don't know what would have happened if we hadn't had the player sent off, but we got three more points than last season. It's going to give uh, us all a boost anyway. Great to see Hoffman score, good goal. So all we can do is look 4-2. Four points, great stuff. Can't Come guys. on, you boys. Think of the game. You said you're a load of cheating bastards. That's what I think. What? So, but the kicking someone in the head is all right, is it? He was going for the ball. Your bloke's putting his head down. It was never a red card. And I tell you what, if we were two on up then, you would have fucking lost because it was shit. Yeah.